Hello friends, welcome to CSAP Space. Today in this video session, we will discuss about how to send an email in ASP.NET Core. So let's start. We open our Visual Studio and here I already created one blank project for ASP.NET Core MEC project. So first of all, I go to this controller. And here we need to uh, add our functions for uh, sending an email. Here in this uh, demo, I am using uh, a demo email and a password. Uh, you can replace with your original ID and password. So first of all, we need to add one new get package manager for uh, sending an email. So I click on manage new get packages. And here we need to search a mail kit mail kit this uh, new get package is used to sending an email with uh, attachments and uh, with different complications as you want so I install it here so currently this is adding the uh, new get package so this new get package is added into the project now we go to our controller and here we need to add some more namespaces using uh, mail kit dot net dot smtb and using uh, mime kit And then we use uh, ASP.NET Core hostings for accessing the www root folder or adding attachment file to with the email. So I am adding it's a Microsoft dot ASP.NET Core dot hosting. Now uh, I am adding one function here like public send email I am adding the result and then return redirect to action now uh, first of all, we need to add a uh, MIME MI, MI message object. So, I'm adding it is MIME message. This message called new MIME message. address here we need to add a mailbox address address I put from new new or uh, mailbox mailbox address and here uh, we provide a name like the demo then here we provide an email that you want to send. It's like uh, I'm adding is a demo from at example.com. And then uh, message.com message dot from we add this from object here. And then here we need to add now we add a tool 
where we need to send the email. So mailbox address mailbox address here we need to like a uh, name we are going to send a uh, mail tool at the rate example dot com then we add this message message dot to dot add and then we add this subject now we set the subject here some message dot subject container different different uh, properties like subject to body cc form you can add a different uh, property here bcc bodies distance, anything you as your requirement so i am adding here like a message uh, subject subject and then we now be creating a body like a body builder equal to body builder equal to new body builder and then body builder dot HTML body equal to like uh, I'm here adding uh, one hello world hello world and then you uh, like a uh, text body we can edit we will do dot text body like uh, hello world and then body builder dot uh, attachments we can add it attachments here so now we can use this environment variable for accessing this uh, www root so here yeah, you can uh, add any files or you can upload a files directly and then use that folder name so for demo purpose i am uh, hard coded the everything from this sub code so attachments dot add so using environment so need to create one environment Accessing this uh, www root, so this is the default variable, so there is no need for this. I hosting is very I hosting environment, and then yeah, I hosting environment. Now env dot web root path we find the web root path then like uh, I am adding any files like a file dot png so you can edit here and then message message dot body we set this body here like a body builder dot to message body now we adding smtp client smtp client 
equal to new SMTP client in client dot connect. Now uh, you can use your address here SMTP host address like I'm adding here S SMTP host address and then here we use a uh, port number your port number like anything that you want and then you use the options ML kit security it's true now client dot authenticate here we provide a user id and passwords like your username your emails and then this is your password password and now uh, we send this message client dot send here we write a message object here this is message then client dot disconnect then we disconnect from this SMTP server here we provide a bull pack and then client dot dispose we dispose we clear the memory so this is the complete method for sending emails you can uh, dynamically add this prompts and uh, from emails to emails and their subject is as as per your requirement and you can call these methods as uh, uh, any line of the code to pass the email id passwords and like a text so uh, here i am providing the uh, demo demo username passwords and email so this will not uh, work by we run so uh, you can uh, use this code to uh, add this uh, mail feature in your project so this is the complete solutions for this so uh, thanks thanks for watching and if you like my videos please click on subscribe button and for getting the latest updates also click on notification bell now we will meet in next video session so thanks thanks for watching